Okay, folks, we're back to Brad and Gina's new home, and wow, wow, wow. Now it looks like a real house, because it is. I mean, you could almost live in it right now. They've got a beautiful siding. They've got a nice front porch. They've got bricks on the front. they got garage doors. they got light fixtures. they got electricity. Let's take a walk inside. There's still some work to be done here, of course, but uh, we're really, really looking at, oh, I don't know. Let's call it 80% for fun. Woo-wee! Look at this beautiful family room. Big vaulted ceiling. That is a big fan, people. I'm a big fan of that fan. All right, look at that fireplace. How pretty. Cabinets are around that. Real nice. And the kitchen is looking pretty sharp. A lot going on here. Whole lot of shaking going on. Hey, the countertops are in. The flooring is in. This looks really good. Oh, my wife is going to be jelly of this. Leather finish. Leather top finish on the counters. This big old laundry room is really sweet. Look at that. Got another little pantry, like a laundry pantry here. I don't know exactly what that is. Why they would have that kitchen here. I forget now. Oh, the dishwasher goes back here as well. So they've got a kitchen sink right here. But they've got another sink over here. And then they've got this place for the uh, storage freezer, I believe, is going back there. Two ovens. This, this place is rocking, dude. Let me tell you, it's rocking. So anyway, and more cabinetry here. Very, very nice. Now, I can't remember everything, so when you get this video, you might not. What, Dean? Anyway, you got a full bath and a shower here off the hallway. Going down this way. Whee! Go down to the garage. Garage, and I think this is also a, um, I forget the flex space here. I thought this was a workout room. Yes, this is going to be a workout room. That's right. For sure. And then they got a one-car garage coming off the first level. Oh, a lot of stuff yet. So I said 80%, maybe 75. But they're looking for a small miracle. And they're making a whole lot of headway. Wow. Look at that red chandelier. This was a family heirloom. And it was kind of old looking, old fashioned looking. And uh, Gina and Brad painted that red. And I have to say, it looks really, really cool. Kudos, guys. Um, let's go finish touring the first floor. But that is slick. <laughs> Very nice. So we keep rolling. Uh, let's see what else we got in the end of the hall. We got a bedroom here. Okay, with a nice size closet. And a Jack and Jill kind of bathroom right here. Real nice. A full tub. Toilet and a double basin sink. Look at that. And another bedroom back here, which I believe is the guest bedroom, which I think makes that first bedroom Declan's bedroom. Uh, pardon me. Wow, guys. This is a laundry room and a half. Look at the counter, sink, and cabinets in this laundry room. Woo wee. That is really, really slick. I love it. So, now we're going to take a look. We passed that bedroom. So, we're going to master bedroom land. There's two entrances, one on each side of the fireplace to the master bedroom. Pretty slick. The one on the left is kind of like the main entrance to the master bedroom. Now this room is just the bedroom. So it's a king bed, night tables, but they got this really slick master bath, custom built for them. So you got your sink and counter on this side. Hey guys, and you got your sink on this side. And then you got a tub and shower together, all tiled, really looking nice. And then you got another shower here, because one shower just ain't enough. These people get messy all the time. I'm not sure why they need two showers, but it's okay. What can I tell you? There's a potty that's going to go in that little closet. All right, and then we're going out the other. This is another closet in here. So we got a closet off this side that's massive. And, uh, wow, tile looks nice. Really cool choice. Anyhow, um, so that's our master closet. We just took a look at the whole first room. Look at, again, look at this family room now. Open floor plan is the buzzword of the day. Vault and ceiling. Hey, birds, looking good. I'm doing my video. Isn't that some fan? That's big. I'm a big fan of that big fan. I'll tell you what. All right, we're going downstairs. Because this is where it really gets fun. Um, I don't know if we can walk on any of the tile yet. Hey, 
I heard you. Woo -doo 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 -doo. Where is the? Uh, oh, there's the bathroom. I'll find my way downstairs eventually. Thank you. Hey, you two better stay up here. Back, but Emily, don't do that. Bring him up. Come on. You guys, wait until you have an adult hey, to go with you. Hey, buddy. Um, How are you? Thank you. Can we go down? Wait, with adults, you can. Yes. Not with me. I'm watching this. I'm on the camera. So I'm going down the staircase. I didn't want the kids to follow me. They get hurt. All right, that's good. Okay, this is so crazy. This is downstairs hallway. Okay, extremely cool, and uh, a whole lot of things going on here. This room to the right has got a lot the utility basin in it. I again don't remember the purpose of all the rooms yet, but this is the basement. And there is a toilet there for sure, coming in out of the backyard, which is awesome. So now we're at ground level backyard. And uh, this is gonna be Gina and Brad's office, which is coming together pretty cool. So they're gonna have a desk here and a desk there. I forget whose is whose. I think this is Brad's office and that's Gina's or vice versa, but they have two offices separated by a sliding door. Um, both of them do a lot of work from home, so it's really helpful for them to have these office spaces. And of course, this is heated and cool and really nice. I'm digging it. Okay, so what else we got? Hmm, hmm, hmm. This is like a little playroom. I think this is Declan's playroom, but I can't remember. I'll figure it out later. Uh, one day at a time. Not sure what this does. Let's see. Ah, this is my favorite room in the house. This is La Garage. La Garage. Oh my goodness, look at that. Is this wet? No, nah, that's plenty dry. So it's been varnished and really cool. This is a one, two, three, four car garage. It is the sexiest part of this house to me. Because I love garages, of course. Look how deep that last bin is. You could bring a nice big old truck in here. Yes, or you could put your boat in here. Whatever you got. It's fun to play with. Oh man, oh man. I just love it. I just love it. And it's just so cool. So we're going to peek out the back door here. You know why? Because we can. This is a view out of the back of the house. There's a nice little creek that runs out there. They've done a lot of grading on the yard since I've been here last. So you can see where eventually they're going to put some concrete. So you can come in around the side of the house and bring your cars down here. Check out the back of this house. This is sexy, man. Yes, this is absolutely what every man wants, a garage. Of course you need a bed and a kitchen, but you want a garage to live in. This is what I want. I love it. Fantastic design. You got toys, this is the place to bring them. Man, oh man, Gene and Brad have built a beautiful home. Like I said, it's really close.